I'm really proud to share this next tin with you. It's a super clean geisha from Jose Luis Eguiguren. Jose Luis's quick rise to the top of Ecuadorian coffee continues to wow me. This past year, I spent time with Jose Luis at his farm and I was super impressed by his knowledge and sophistication just nine years into his coffee journey. By the way, I love his story. His family had been producing coffee up until the 1990s. Then they had to abandon their farm. Then in 2015, he had an experience with a Kenyan coffee in Portland that totally changed his outlook on coffee. He then decided to replant his family farm with a strict focus on producing top-end quality coffee. The farm is called Hacienda Santa Gertrudis, and he planted it in 2017 with Sidra, Katura, Tipica Mejorado, and Geisha. This is only his fifth harvest, and he's already producing world-class coffees. Now let's talk about the cup for a moment. This is not a massive coffee that's gonna hit you in the face with its flavors, but I love how floral it is and how well it represents what the geisha variety is all about. I find the tangerine and nectarine flavors dominate, followed by lingering earl gray and lilac flowers with a hint of lemongrass. It's such an elegant coffee that it makes me wanna to fly to Ecuador and give Jose Luis a big hug. I normally don't talk about brewing in these videos, but I've been really enjoying this coffee as a V60, so I suggest you try that out. We're gonna have this coffee for a super limited time online and on Brew to Order, so hope you get your hands on it. Very nice. <laughs>